<laughs> All right, so Kelly, we talked about it. Today was just a picture perfect Saturday, but I know we do have some potentially dangerous weather coming around the corner. Yeah, you know, this is the time of year where we expect to see that our own March madness here where we have these big temperature swings and that is what we're experiencing today. We have a warm front that is to our north, so that's been ushering in that warm air from the south and we have the system to our south as well, so that's taking away a little bit of our moisture right now, but we have tornado watches off to our south, severe thunderstorm watches to our west, and all of this is going to be moving in along a cold front. Right now we're quiet and dry on live Doppler 13 radar. 74 degrees right now in Muncie, 69 in Richmond, 73 degrees in Greencastle, and we do have a risk of severe weather. Again, where we have these tornado warnings, that is where we're in that enhanced position for the higher risk of severe weather. For us, we do have a risk of severe weather for Indianapolis and toward the west, a little bit higher risk and in south central Indiana. Hail looks to be the main threat. We still could see some damaging winds and perhaps a few isolated tornadoes. So the timing frame does look to be around 9 p.m. until about 3 o'clock in the morning. We're looking at damaging winds and hail as the main threats. However, we could see some isolated tornadoes. We could see some gusty winds out of these storms as well. So let's look at this hour by hour on future track. This is at 7 p.m. As we go to about 8, 9 o'clock tonight, we're going to start to see the leading edge where this cold front will start triggering these thunderstorms and we could see some heavy rain out of these as well as it marches off to the northeast we will continue to monitor west central Indiana with that potential of those damaging winds. This will continue to move in after midnight. We'll still have that um, the strength of those starting to die down. However, we'll start to see this next wave with the low pressure system triggering a few more thunderstorms in south central Indiana. The bad news is it's at night because that allows people to go to sleep and you make sure that you have the live Doppler 13 radar app on your phone for those notifications. As we go into morning hours tomorrow, things will start to die down. This will move out and then we're going to be in the wake of that cold front. Temperatures will fall to around 45 degrees first thing tomorrow morning, but we're not going to see much of a warm up tomorrow. In fact, the winds will be out of the northwest. They're going to be gusting around 25 to 30 miles per hour. So it is going to be a blustery afternoon. We're going to see temperatures basically climbing into the upper 40s to near 50 degrees tomorrow afternoon. It will remain cloudy and cool. The good news is we're going to rebound the start of the work week. So tomorrow we'll have we'll start off with those storms during the early morning hours. Blustery conditions Sunday afternoon. High of 51 with those gusts around 30 miles per hour. On Monday we'll see a beautiful day. Mild 60 degrees. We're into the upper 60s to near 70 degrees Tuesday afternoon. Another cold front moves through Tuesday night, bringing us more showers into Wednesday morning.